your playful neighborhood scientist. Where's the friendly neighborhood scientist, you ask? Well, she says she can't do an experiment this week because she has homework to do. Wait, I think I have homework to do too. Oh no! Ah! Ah! Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Homework. Let's find it. No. Is it inside here? No. before taking my hat? Oh uh, god, I think for Wang Li, I will tell you later, okay? It's not like you wear it very often. Anyway, let me show you this magic trick. So here, I have a glass full of water. I've coloured the water green, so you can see that there are no camera tricks happening. Next, I'm going to take this piece of card and place it over the mouth of the glass. And next, I'm going to flip. And finally, I'm going to remove my hand from the glass and ta-da! You can see that the water stays inside the glass. Now, how did I do this? Well, a magician never reveals their secrets. But I will. All you need are a glass, some water, you can add some food colouring to it if you wish, a card that's big enough to cover the mouth of the glass, and a big tub to do the experiment over. Firstly, pour water into the glass until it is completely full. You can add some food colouring if you want to colour the water. Next, place the card over the mouth of the glass. Make sure that the card is completely covering the mouth. Thirdly, and shh, this is the secret here, use your palm to press the card firmly against the mouth of the glass. You can check that it is tight by trying to shift the card around. If it doesn't move, you're good to flip. And next, with your hand still on the card, flip the glass. And finally, slowly remove your hand and ta-da! The card should hold the water inside the glass. So why doesn't the card fall and cause water to spill everywhere? That's because of air pressure. Even though it doesn't feel like it, the air around us actually pushes against us from all directions. When we flip the glass upside down, air molecules are pushing up on the card from below. The pressure of the air molecules is greater than the weight of the water inside the glass. And that stops the water from pushing the card down. And that's why the card does not fall, it stays in place, keeping the water in the glass and not letting it spill. So, what does air pressure have to do with our daily lives? Well, a lot. Air pressure is involved in everything we do, from blowing up balloons and drinking through a straw, to riding bicycles and even making sure our bodies don't deflate. Anyway, that's all for today's episode of Science O'Clock. I hope my teacher and classmates will be impressed with my magic trick. Do you have any other scientific magic tricks to share? Let us know in the comments! If you try this experiment, remember to tag us in your photos and videos. We love watching you do science at home. I hope you've enjoyed watching today's episode of Science O'Clock. Have fun experimenting and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye!